objectives and question answers of the lesson. Wastewater Story Class 7, Science Fill in the blanks. Cleaning of water is process of removing pollutants. Wastewater released by houses is called sewage. Dry dash is used as manure. Sludge. Drains get blocked by dash and dash. Chemicals and kitchen waste. What is sewage? Explain why it is harmful to discharge untreated sewage into rivers or seas. Sewage is a liquid containing wastes which is disposed by households, industrial, and agricultural activities in the water. It is harmful to discharge untreated sewage into rivers or seas because it can pollute the whole sources of water. Sewage contains harmful substances and disease-causing organisms. It is therefore dangerous to release untreated sewage in water. Why should oils and fats be not released in the drain? Explain. Oils and fats should not be released in drains because they harden this oil in the pipes and block them. Fats get clogged in holes of the soil in the drain and block it. It does not allow the water to flow. Describe the steps involved in getting clarified water from wastewater. Following steps are involved in the purification of water. Firstly all the physical impurities like stones, plastic bags, cans, etc. are to be removed. It is done by passing the water through bar screens. Then water is taken to the grit and sand removal tank where impurities are removed by sedimentation. Solid impurities and feces etc. are collected from the bottom of the water. These impurities collected are called sludge. Clarified water is cleaned of other impurities by the aerator. All disease-causing bacteria are removed by chlorination. What is sludge? Explain how it is treated. Sludge is the collected solid waste from the wastewater during the treatment in the water treatment plant. Sludge is decomposed in a separate tank by the anaerobic bacteria. Activated sludge is used as manure. Untreated human excreta is a health hazard. Explain. Untreated human excreta can cause a lot of health-related problems. It pollutes water, air, and soil. The polluted water contains disease-causing bacteria, which can spread epidemics like cholera, meningitis, etc. Name two chemicals used to disinfect water. Chlorine and ozone. Explain the junction of bar screens in a wastewater treatment plant. Bar screens clear the wastewater of all the physical impurities. Large size waste like napkins, plastics, cans, etc. are removed from the wastewater through the bar screens. Explain the relationship between sanitation and disease. Sanitation and disease are related to each other. Sanitation involves proper disposal of sewage and refuse from house and public places. If sanitation is there, no disease will occur, but if sanitation is not there various types of disease will occur unspread. So sanitation should be kept to avoid disease. Outline your role as an active citizen in relation to sanitation.
as an active citizen, we should take care of our personal environmental sanitation. We should make people aware of the benefits of sanitation. We should help municipal corporations to cover all the open drains, and remove disease-causing substances thrown in open. Study the following statements about ozone. A. It is essential for the breathing of living organisms. B. It is used to disinfect water. C. It absorbs ultraviolet rays. And D. Its proportion in air is about 3%. Which of these statements are correct? Number 1, A, B, and C. Number 2, Band C. Number 3, A and D. Number 4, All 4. Answer Number 2, B and C. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel, and do not forget, to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.